Okay, so today I have decided to create a follow-up video on the, what are they called again? Lark water bottle. Mainly because so many people watched my original review video and a lot of people have been very curious about how my replacement bottle has been working and I never really provided an update. So hopefully this will satisfy a lot of people. For the most part, ever since I started using the replacement bottle, I have not had issues with it. The main thing is just that I don't really use the bottle much anymore. It started to feel a little tedious because I would have off and on time periods where I was using it a lot and then I would stop using it. And then when I wanted to resume using it again, I had to charge the cap first. And I also feel like I have a view on this water bottle that might not be correct. But I feel like I believe that, yes, it is a self-cleaning water bottle, but I would not trust for you to never need to wash it manually, right? So even though you use the cap, and I feel like I'm comfortable with using the cap for a couple days, I still don't feel like I would like the idea of going, you know, more than a week without at least manually washing it. Maybe that's the wrong way to think about it. Maybe me manually washing it is unnecessary, but I feel like when I first bought the bottle, they didn't go too in depth with stuff like that. So even if you don't wash the bottle, I still feel like it's very important for you to wash the lip area, right? Because the, the light does not touch the outside lip area where you're putting your mouth on it. And then also the cap up here in itself, I feel like it's worth cleaning the inside of it just because you never know what's going to be growing in there. And once again, I don't believe that's an area where the light is touching it. So I'll just show you guys. Um, this was my original one. I feel like I probably could have discarded it by now, but since the construction is very nice, the bottle in itself is nice. And I guess when I pull it out now, I really like the look of it and just the feel of it. Yeah, I have not used in a very long time. And this is my current new bottle, which I actually decided to just use the entire bottle instead of just replacing the cap because I had this personalized when I initially bought it. But yeah, I also feel like another big reason why I stopped using it is because I've realized that whatever the size it was, 16.9 fluid ounces, I believe. Oh yes, it says here 500 milliliters, 17 ounces. That is just too little for me. If I brought one bottle of this outside or if I'm using this frequently while I'm in the house, it requires too many refills. And I feel like for somebody of my size and wanting to live a good healthy lifestyle, I feel like I should be drinking 90 to 100 fluid ounces a day, maybe a little bit less than that, but I feel like that ballpark is pretty good. And a size like this is way too small. So I'm an introvert for the most part. I'm home a lot. So if I have to keep walking to my kitchen to refill this because I'm chugging it down, for me, if I ever have a drink right in front of me, I am constantly sipping at it. That's just the way that I am. That's also why alcohol is very dangerous for me to just leave sitting there because I'll just keep sipping it no matter the alcohol concentration, I'll just get myself tipsy real fast. That's also why I decided to buy a hydro flask recently. So this is just something that I started wanting to focus on more again because I feel like the past several months actually my water intake has not been ideal. Uh, I have a cup over there. I have no idea what the size is, but I feel like I would drink maybe two of those a day. Sometimes I would wake up and I wouldn't drink water for half the day stuff like that. So I also figured that wanting a bigger size than that, so I don't have to keep really refilling it. I decided to buy a 40 ounce from Hydro Flask and I would be happy if I drank two full amounts of these per day. Honestly, this doesn't even feel like that big of a difference, a little bit of width and a little bit of height, but this is just really small. And I do find charging the cap, this isn't so much an update on how this is doing because it's doing fine. Uh, I have not had problems with it, but just for my personal use and my personal preferences, I'm no longer really using this as much anymore. 
I am always very surprised by how many people watch my original video and continue to watch it. And I do hope that it is still very helpful uh, for those that are interested in buying the bottle. But this is just the little amount that I can provide as an update. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you guys have a great weekend.